Now next question. The question is like this. 2 by root x plus 3 by root y is equal to 2. 4 by root x minus 9 by root y is equal to minus 1. Here, rewrite that uh, in this form. Coefficient and uh, variable term separate. So, 2 into 1 by root x, 3 into 1 by root y. Similarly, here 4 into 1 by root x, 9 into 1 by root y. Then, 1 by root x and 1 by root y. These are the variable terms here that can be replaced by u and v. Uh, you can use any other variable other than this uh, x and y. Or you can use capital X, capital Y or capital A, capital B, capital B. Anyway, you can use but you have to use any other variable other than this small x and a small y. So, u and v here. Then uh, this equation 1 and 2 now reduce to 2 u. 1 by root x become u. Then 3 root v is equal to 2 and 4 u minus 9 v equal to minus 1. Then solving this two equation using elimination method. Uh, for that, uh, here uh, first equation 2u. Uh, the coefficient of 2 u 2. Uh, here second 4. So if you multiply the first equation by 2, the number 2, then uh, this become 4u. Then you can subtract that will be cancelling this or eliminating this uh, u. So first you have to do third equation into 2. Make that uh, coefficient uh, of u as same. So, third equation into 2 become 4u plus 6v equal to 4. That is equation number 5. And just I rewrite this fourth equation say here uh, to make that uh, for a convenience. Okay. Then uh, subtract 5 minus 4. 4 minus 4, 0. Then uh, they here become plus uh, dt inverse. So, then 15v equal to 5. So, v equal to 1 by 3. Similarly, previous may previous question as previous question we can do we substitute v in uh, the first uh, third equation here the third equation where uh, here third equation then uh, uh, there we can get uh, u equal to one by two. Now the answer is not fully over u and v now we get uh, what to do the next uh, you have to resubstitute. So v equal to one by three which implies uh, we substitute here one by root x equal to u. So, uh, and 1 by root y equal to v. So, v equal to 1 by 3 which implies 1 by root y equal to 1 by 3. This root uh, 1 to, uh, this root, uh, if you uh, make this a root, uh, you are not able to get an answer. So, we can square both sides. This equation, both sides if you square, this root uh, uh, become complete number. So, y Okay, root will go. So, so 1 by root y whole square. That is 1 by y. 1 by 3 square, 1 by 9. Squaring on both sides. So, 1 by y equal to 1 by 9. So, that become, now the equation become in y. So, y is equal to what happened? Cross multiplication, y equal to 9. Similarly, u equal to 1 by 2, which implies 1 by root x equal to 1 by 2. And uh, here also squaring on both sides. So this condition you have to square. Okay. So 1 by root x square. That is 1 by x. Uh, 1 by 2 square. That is 1 by 4. So then what is x? Uh, x cross multiplying. x equal to 4. So now we get x equal to 4. And y equal to 9 as an answer. Third question. Question is like this. 5 by x minus 1 plus 1 by y minus 2 is equal to 2. 6 by x minus 1 minus 3 by y minus 2 is equal to 1. If you are rewriting as coefficient and variable, 5 into 1 by x minus 1. Here, 1 by y minus 2 itself. So, 1 by x minus 1, 1 by y minus 2. Those are the variable terms. So, we can substitute that u and v. So, what is 1? Now, it change as 5u plus v is equal to 2. And equation number 2 changes 6u minus 3v equal to 1. Then as usual our elimination method here also I used an elimination method to solve these two equations. For making the coefficients equal here, here it is v in the third equation. Here it is 3v. So if you multiply here 3, this coefficient becomes same. Uh, to eliminate that v. So multiply the third equation into the number 3. Then uh, equation number 3 becomes 5, 15u, 5 into 3, 15u plus 3v is equal to 6. Then if you add these two equations, already this uh, both having different signs of this uh, same coefficient term. These terms uh, have different signs means you can add to eliminate these two uh, terms. Okay, So add these two equations, then this v eliminate and you will get answer as 21 u equal to 7 and u equal to 1 by 3.
then what to do then you can substitute in a uh, condition number three or four so i substitute here in three and get the answer v is equal to one by three even then if u and v are ready now then we have to resubstitute in these two conditions to get x and y so u equal to 1 by 3 which implies 1 by x minus 1 equal to 1 by 3 so cross multiplying x minus 1 equal to 3 so x equal to 4 v is equal to 1 by 3 which implies 1 by y minus 2 equal to 1 by 3 uh, which implies y minus 2 equal to 3 so y equal to 5 so x equal to 4 and y is equal to 5 is a solution of these two equations Next question, 7x minus 2y by xy equal to 5 and 8x plus 7y by xy, xy equal to 15. So here one xy term is there. That term should be eliminated from there before solving. For that, 7x first step, you just cross multiply and make the equation like this. 7x minus 2y equal to 5xy, 8x plus 7y equal to 15xy. After that, you divide this uh, both equation by xy, then xy term will not be there in the uh, equation. So, divide by xy means here what will happen? x and uh, y and y get cancelled, and uh, x, y, uh, sorry, x and x which cancel, and y is remaining, so 7 by y. Denominator y is remaining. Here 2y by xy, x and uh, x get cancelled, sorry, y and y get cancelled, and remaining is s, uh, that is in the denominator, so 2 by x. What will happen in the right side? 5xy by xy. xy, xy get cancelled and remaining 5. Similarly here, 8x, x and x get cancelled and 8 by y will be there. 7y, y and y get cancelled and x is remaining. So 7 by x and there xy term will be uh, cancelling. After that, uh, 15 is remaining. Then what to do? We can give 1 by y and 1 by x now. So for that, uh, u and v u and v substituting this equation reduces to like this 7u minus 2v equal to 5 and 8u plus 7v equal to 15. I uh, am doing this uh, question using cross multiplication for that uh, make this equation in the standard form. After that what to do standard form uh, uh, making the standard form and rearranging the coefficient and variables in such a way that b c a b and uh, cross multiplying and uh, subtracting. So u by minus 2 into minus 15 that is plus 30 minus minus 35 that become plus 35 v by minus 5 into plus 8 that is minus 40 uh, minus minus 1.5 that is a plus 1.5 here also 7 into 7 49 minus minus 16 that is plus 16 then uh, u by 65 v by 65 and uh, 1 by 65 then 1 and the last one equating u equal to 1. V and the, sorry second and last equating v equal to 1. Then uh, resubstituting u equal to 1 which implies uh, 1, by u, 1 by y equal to 1. So y equal to 1. V equal to 1 which implies 1 by x equal to 1. So x equal to 1. So x equal to 1 and y equal to 1 is a solution of these two equations. Next question. Seventh one. 10 by x plus y plus 2 by x minus y equal to 4, 15 by x plus y minus 5, 5 by x minus y equal to minus 2. You can do by taking that u equal to 1 by x plus y and v equal to 1 by x minus y and it reduces to, first equation reduces to 10 u plus 2 v equal to 4. That can be again reduced to divided by 2, divided by 2 both sides <coughs> uh, will get a 5 u plus v equal to 4. Sorry, 5v plus v equal to 2. Then here 15u minus 5v equal to minus 2. You from this equation, second number. And no uh, reduction, you keep it in the same way as equation number 4. Here it is 3. Then uh, here elimination method using. So uh, for that, uh, for making the equating the coefficient of v. Here it is minus 5. Here it is uh, uh, v. So you can multiply by 5. So when you are multiplying this equation number 3 by 5, 25u plus 5v equal to 10, then 15 is the uh, fourth equation. I'll just rewrite here for our uh, convenience to add here the two equations. Rewriting that fourth equation down again, you do addition to eliminate this uh, v. So 25 plus 15, 14u is equal to 10 minus 2, 8. Then u equal to 1 by 5. Then substitute in the condition number 3. Uh, we'll get uh, v equal to 1. Now we get u and v. <clears throat> then substitute in this uh, uh, 
uh, 1 by x plus y and 1 by x minus y. What you are getting here? x plus y, again one more condition you are getting. You are not getting x as answer here. Here we are getting x plus y equal to 5. Second case you are getting, uh, you get here x minus y is equal to 1. Look here, again two more equations. We didn't get the uh, correct answer as x and y. So, what to do? Again, want to solve these two equations in x and y to get x and y as a uh, value of x and y. So, again, you have to use uh, any one of the method to solve this uh, uh, two equations. Uh, is that, uh, here, uh, again, elimination method used. Uh, direct add, you can, you can sub add these two equations. Uh, to eliminate y and get x, 2x equal to 6, then x equal to 3, so and substitute in another condition, that's the sixth condition, then we can get y is equal to 2, so now we get x equal to 3 and y equal to 2 as a solution of uh, the given equations.